The rapidly growing mobile phone industry has one thing to thank for its evolution. Competition. Competition. Experts say in the race to be the best, consumers make out with better options. That's lower prices and newer products. If you look at the innovation that comes with the services, the, the calling plans, um, the added on services and all that, then it is very, very clear that once the monopoly of, of uh, Telecom Kenya on one side and once uh, um, uh, Safaricom's competitors with Zane and all the others came in, then obviously everybody went back to the drawing board, came up with new calling plans and came up with uh, other services including data and all that to add up to that. The top two brands have proven that healthy competition drives innovation. Now the competition between the two major players, that is Safaricom and Zane, has seen the prices come down dramatically. But still, as much as Zane tries to penetrate the market, yeah, Safaricom keeps on hitting uh, Zane quite hard. An awareness of the fact that uh, the mobile phone services and the provision of, 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 of that service is not necessarily about voice. I think an expansion of the, of the field, uh, or rather of the view of, uh, of the managers of these of mobile phone companies or telecommunication services companies is, uh, is expanding. Uh, all that coming from the fact that yes, competition internally uh, is almost consolidated or uh, if, 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 if a competitor is far ahead, a competing company is far ahead, then I think uh, one other company has to think about how do we provide the same service in, a more, in, in an expanded area where, where we can compete effectively. And while the competition heats up, analysts predict even more saturation into the business and education sectors, but a possible clash with the banking industry. The banking services are becoming more expensive than Safaricom maybe or Zane uh, actually intended it to be because it's a service that most of Kenyans have subscribed to, they're willing to use, it's cheaper, it's faster, it's convenient. But then, you know, the banking are raising an issue that the mobile industry is offering banking services and they are not being regulated by the Banking Act. So if they go that way, the, the the banking services being offered currently by the phone industry become more expensive. Who knows what products and services companies will come up with next? But as the battle of the brands continues, consumers should brace for the information surge. Renita Young, Eyewitness Business.